Hi friends, welcome back to All on in Law. Today I'm gonna talk about briefly about insulin preparations and its uses. Insulin preparations and its uses. I'm gonna talk about the onset of action, how long does it gonna act for and what's the peak and when we should use. Okay guys, so this is a really very important topic for medical students and even for nursing students also. So try to understand this, okay. So before starting uh, a discussion on this, I would request you to subscribe to our channel and please do share our videos with your friends. Okay guys, let me start with the types of insulins we have. Remember, we'll start with the ultra rapid acting insulin okay as name itself indicates they are ultra rapid so they're gonna act in a fastest way okay compared to other types of insulin so which are those insulins let's start with the insulin aspart okay then we have insulin Lispro. Okay, these are really very important for USLB, USMLA examinations also and other board examinations also. Glulizine. Okay, guys. So these are the ultra rapid acting insulins insulin aspart, insulin Lispro, insulin Glulizine. Okay, so now the onset of action the aspart. Okay, I'm gonna talk about in the hours. Okay, it's gonna take less than 0 0.25 hours. Okay, I'm talking in the form of hours. Okay, less than 0 0.25. Whereas Lispro, it takes 0 0.25 to 0 0.5. Okay, whereas insulin glulazine, it takes 0 0.2 to 0.5 okay so if we take it to open fire as 30 minutes so it's gonna be 15 minutes right the aspart will act within 15 minutes whereas Lespro starts acting from 15 to 20 30 minutes and this is gonna take I think around what you call it or 20 25 or sorry around 15 minutes to half an hour right so remember among these aspart is the fastest acting right good all right well, let's start with uh, peak when they will reach the peak okay so the peak I'm gonna talk about in the hours it's gonna be one to three hours okay whereas uh, Lispro will take 0 0.5 to what you call 2.5 okay and then we have this one is 1.5 to 2.5 okay guys so this is about the peak look at the peak also peak is really very important and the most important now I'm going to talk about is the duration of action how long does it going to take duration okay the duration look the as part the as part it acts for three to five hours okay as part it acts for three to five hours whereas this the less pro three to five hours okay and whereas glue lasagna it takes for the same period but less one hour that's of three to four hours Okay, guys. So, did you get me? Ultra rapid acting. We have aspart, lispro, and glulazine. And the hours it starts, the peak it reaches, and the duration. Uh, how long does it gonna act for? Okay. So, when to use this uh, ultra rapid acting insulin? Just remember, this is really they act very rapidly. So that that's why we should give right before the meals. Remember, right before the meals. Okay, right before the meals. Very important. Okay, let's move on to the next type of insulin that is rapid, rapid acting insulin, rapid acting insulin, okay. In the rapid acting insulin, we have regular insulin, okay, we have a regular insulin. Okay, the onset of action of regular insulin, it's going to start in 0 0.5, that is 30 minutes to 1 hour, okay onset I'm gonna talk about the peak it's gonna be what you call 2.2 to 4 you can write it 2 to 4 and duration is 5 to 8 
so duration is really very important this is duration this is peak this is onset okay so when to use uh, regular insulin remember uh, this can be given IV also okay uh, this is for inpatients okay and it's given before the meals but usually one hour or 30 minutes before a meal for outpatients okay it can be used for, given for outpatient also but remember it should be given within 0 0.5 to 1 hour or 30 minutes to 1 hour before a meal okay right now let's move on to the immediate to long acting insulin sorry intermediate to long acting then we have a long acting okay long acting insulin LA the, we have the most important is NPH insulin this is really very important insulin so onset affection of this insulin is what you call 2 to 3 hours okay the peak it reaches 4 to 12 hours and whereas duration is for 12 to 20 hours okay remember this is NPH insulin NPH insulin is really very important so what kind of use it has okay remember this is it is used in the standard regimens okay if you if you, if you want to know different types of regimens I discussed this before in my video uh, you can search it in my channel that's a uh, common insulin regimens you will get the insulin regimens okay so there you can find the uses of NPH also it's used along with the regular insulin in the form of 70 to 30 50 to 50 NPH to regular and uh, NPH to regular ratio okay so it's a kind of what you call a regimen okay all right now let's move on to the long acting insulin long acting insulin in this we have glargine in, in this we have glargine and ditima okay guys so in insulin glargine it onset peak and duration right in the onset In the onset we have uh, for this insulin glargine is 1.5 that's to 4 hours so how look at the onset affection it's gonna take a longer time so peak we don't know anything about that it, is, it depends so more than 24 hours is going to be the duration of this uh, drug okay this sorry this insulin the ditema uh, is nearly 3 to 4 is what you call onset peak is 3 to 10 or a 9 hours okay and um, the duration it's already called it's less than 24 hours you can say or it depends on the dose how much you gave okay guys so this is about the insulin glargine okay what are the uses of this insulin glargine and insulin determiner that's a long acting insulin or the glargine provides a basal insulin levels and supplements with a short acting insulin this can be used for a regimen also the ditema it provides the basal insulin level okay so this doesn't have much uses compared to the what you call intermediate rapid acting or ultra short acting okay guys so thank you so much for watching this video i hope you understood the basic concepts about insulin preparations and its uses if you like the video thumb up and please do share our videos with your friends take care